Hands are normally working on sets and lighting and all other aspects of productions on the stage at the Lyric Opera House. But with shows canceled during the pandemic, they have plenty of time to work on the other side of the stage, installing the more than 3,000 new seats in the historic theater. We're usually working on a show every day, and it's really odd to not be doing that right now. It's a painstaking process. The Lyric is one of a handful of major opera houses in the world, and much of the building is protected with landmark status. And they closely monitor any change in the theater that could impact the acoustics, which allow audiences to hear every note from the singers on stage. But the new seats will also allow audiences to see the stage better. They've poured new concrete on the floor, put in new carpeting, and curved the aisles to allow the rows of seats to be offset. So now you can look between two seats at the stage rather than at the back of the person's head sitting in front of you. We had to tear up all the concrete, extra, put in extra new air vents, um, move a lot of electrical just to make um, the main floor a better seating experience. The new configuration will have nearly 300 fewer seats than before spread out between the main floor and the three balcony levels. It will also improve wheelchair accessibility. They got input from audience members for months before embarking on the project. Originally, they planned to cram the work in during the summer between shows. Then COVID-19 hit and they canceled the entire season, which allows them to do the work during what would normally be the fall season. All those decisions, we, we want the building to retain that um, historic quality to it. The old seats look pretty similar to the new seats, but the new seats are designed to be a little more comfortable, more durable, and a little roomier. Now they just can't wait for audiences to get to sit in them. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.